is the dating app that aims to strike a blow against superficiality. But will it work? Do you do dancing after work? Yes. You are hearing the awkward small talk of a first date coming from underneath those paper bags. Could this be the newest trend in dating? What's your sign? Sagittarius. I knew it. Call it the Tinder backlash. With 30 million accounts and counting on the notorious dating app, people are relying on technology more than ever to hook up. Hey girl, Tinder's for dating and mating and gyrating. It's not just for hooking up, perfs. And take it from the Mindy Project, the dating app world can be a challenge. Can you heart it? Whoops, just accidentally axed it. <sighs> but one new dating app is trying to get beyond the sexy selfies. This is Love Flutter. Dubbed the anti-Tinder, Love Flutter users match with one another based on 140 character blurbs before their photos are revealed. And at special events, daters hide behind paper bags and hope sparks fly based on personality alone. When you're under there, I think uh, it's a good way of, of, you know, making the real you shine. I'm a nice person. <laughs> Brandon Harris is new to New York and looking to meet people. If you meet somebody and they have a really good personality, you click, they automatically become more attractive. Are you here with friends? Amanda Moy met her last boyfriend through traditional speed dating and thought she'd give paper bags a go this time. I wanted to express myself as a unicorn. Because I'm unique and mystical. Switch. We got a switch. They have two minutes with one another to see if there's a connection. I don't know if it's the bag or if you're drunk, because it sounds like you're drunk. At the end, the bags come off for the big reveal. The results seem to be, if you'll excuse the pun, a mixed bag. Do you think there are more likes or passes in this group? <laughs> I don't want to say. I think by the time you start to even maybe certainly scratch, like scratch the surface, it was time to switch. The creators of Love Flutter remain optimistic that online daters can get beyond the pretty face. We've yet to see the first paperback marriage, but that will be yeah, next on the cards.